Well, hey, hi, howdy, hello. What do you know? I'm looking for something to hold up my phone. <laughs> and it's 11 to 2, 11 to 2. No, it's, it's 11 22 on the 2, 11 to 2. February 11th. That's what I'm trying to say. I was trying to make it as complicated as possible. How'd I do? <laughs> I'm doing pretty good over here, too, I might add. I'm getting the way to hold up the phone. There we go. Hey! Hi! It's not too late to take a deep breath and let it go before the end of the day, and that's what I'm here to do. I'm still in some of my snowboarding outfit, including my snowboarding hairdo. And I even forgot my fancy furry hat or anything, so you're welcome. Ah, mostly, I've learned that without holding myself accountable to y'all out there, I got no one to hold myself accountable to, and I don't do so good without accountability. So here I am, holding myself accountable to myself, and just uh, using the imaginary, ethereal you that is you to help. So thanks. I'm going to run through a little bit of letting go of stress, a little bit of stretching out these arms, which have been definitely accumulating some stress, some weakness, and some stress. Just shake that off a little bit. I'm going to do a little wacky, wavy, inflatable arm tube man impression first. I just recently read a little bit of the history of the wacky, wavy, inflatable arm tube man. I had no idea. Now I, now I know. The more you learn, the more you know, or the more you know you don't know, actually. I think that's more accurate. Let's do a little free arm swinging, also. I can't really get you at a better angle yet. Yet, but I will. I will very soon. Let's see, that might not be true. Maybe I can get you at a better angle. I use this deck of cards over here. Ooh, I hope I don't drop you. <laughs> All right. Let's do some arms stretching across the body. I'm going to breathe along the way and just wiggle that shoulder around and wiggle that arm around. Did you notice I got my house to myself for a night? It's a pretty exciting thing in my life these days. You gotta take what you can get. Let's do some deep breaths, some big circles. I'm gonna breathe in on the way up. Exhaling on the way down. Getting the knees involved and the eyes. Go the other way. Shake that off a little bit. Let's do medium circles. I'm going to still breathe in on the way up, exhale on the way down. I could take off the vest, I suppose. Had it on all day because I was up in the snows. It was warm though. Warm in the snow today. 
I heard some kind of rumor about 90 degrees in California or something. I'm going to look into that here in a little bit when I check the daily headlines. This is too short of rules the other way. Shake that out. Ooh, I got some hitches in my neck. I'm wearing my helmet. It's actually from looking down the mountain. Hmm. Let's see. Let's do little little circles. I forgot where I was. We did big and medium circles. Let's do some little circles with the fingers. Just checking in on those. Oh, yep, but they're pretty stiff. And the other way. <sighs> Don't forget to breathe and smile or scowl and hold your breath like you mean it. Put your back into it. Shake that off. Shake it all off. Do a little wacky, wavy, inflatable arm tube man. Get things a little more loosened up. <sighs> mm-hmm. This is what happens when I don't do my live stream stretches. I just, I just stiffen up like a rigor mortis thing. A rigor mortis thing? That's what I said. A living dead girl. That's what I meant. I'm going to bring my weight over to my right and bring my left knee up toward my left shoulder. Let's do some little circles on the side. See if I can balance without my giant boots. And the other way, remember to relax that supporting side if you can. <laughs> and if you go over, tuck and roll. <clears throat> and regain some kind of connection with the center of the earth and the center of the sky. Mm, let's do some medium circles. From the knee, I can't tell if you can see me on the medium circle there and the other way. Try not to count or lean too far. Let's do some big hip circles. <laughs> you can see I'm cheating. There's no such thing as cheating when it comes to checking in with your own body. Is that one way? Not one right way, not one wrong way. Oh, those legs. That's from that last run. I did the whole thing down the mountain. Actually, I did several because I met my buddy there, and I cannot go as fast as him, which I love. There's not many people on this earth that I can't go faster than, let alone as fast as. It's just a couple, just a couple few that I've met. There's probably more I haven't met yet. <laughs> I'm gonna bring my weight on to the left. <sighs> Relax the shoulders. Tuck the tailbone under a little bit and bring in this right knee up toward right shoulder. Hmm. Relaxing that supporting side. <sighs> Try not to fall over. But if I do, I don't know if I'll tuck him wrong or not because I got a glass table over there. I might stiffen up and plank it onto the floor. Let's not try it. Let's not try it. I'm going to do some little circles with the ankles. I know you weren't worried if I was still silly. So there you have that. Going the other way. Oh. A supporting side is a weak and sore. It's both weak and worn out. That's all right. Let's try that some more. Relaxing that supporting side. I'm bringing this knee up. Relaxing the shoulders. Tucking the tailbone under a little bit. Just trying to find a nice long and strong relaxed line 
from the center of the earth through the bottom of my relaxed foot, up through the center of the body. See my whole body be like, I can't do it, Captain. All right, let's do medium circles from the knee. Still living in a musical. Whew, yep. I didn't go very long snowboarding today, but I did ride pretty hard. Like I mentioned, I was trying to go faster than my buddy, but I can't do it no matter how fast I go. <laughs> Let's try some sloppy big circles, shall we? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I'm also trying out for my my uh, new show called The Unfunny Comedian in Training. That's me. Let's do one more round. With big circles in that note. Setting the bar real low. Like on the ground, kind of low. Let's do a little bit of stretching out these really tired legs. Coming into a straddle position. And just dip in on the sides. That brings the stretch down into the inner thighs. They're telling me that I pushed them right around to the limit. I'm grateful that they didn't cry out or give up on me. Oh, I was riding them hard down the mountain. <laughs> mm. Did I mention I love snowboarding lately? Because I do. It's pretty good. I gotta, I gotta just say. Let's do some more stretching. Let's add to that stretch. Shall we? I'm gonna add some arm over. Dipping on the left and then Adding a little arm over. And again, dipping on the right. Stretching the left toward the right. I'm still focusing that stretch on the inner thighs, but I'm about to shift it. After one more time on each side here. Over to the left. And then Coming back to center, let's walk these feet back together under the hips. And I'm going to push into that hip on the left. And push into the hip on the right. Ah, don't forget your heavy size. If you feel like it, and do a little bit of Pushing into that hip. Be mindful of your own hips. That feels good to me because I keep them stretched, but uh, I don't want to go forcing any stretches anywhere, really, but especially in those ball and socket joints like the hips. I'm going to bend the knees, put my feet under the hips again, and now do some hip slides over to the left. For me, that brings a stretch up into the torso. Ooh, got a little hitch in that SI joint, so just going to love on that a little bit. Sliding over to the right. Helps sometimes to pull that hip down on the side. Bending the knees. Sliding over to the left. And pulling down a little bit. So as to get a nice stretch in the torso. And over to the right. Over to the left. I think I need to go snowboarding more often. I'm sore. A little bit. A little bit stiff and sore. Tells me I'm not snowboarding enough. That's the answer. More snowboarding. Hey, Sabrina. Good to see you. I hope you're doing great. Mm. I'm wishing you and everyone out there a happy, loving weekend. I do hope to be back sooner than later. As I mentioned, it helps me keep myself accountable by sharing.
sharing a little breathing and stretching and strengthening and silliness with you. Try to remind you that you are worthy of your own love too. So I hope you're practicing that. Mm -hmm. I hope you and your body are getting along well and that you're finding lots of good ways to keep that relationship healthy. Mm -hmm. And I do thank you for stopping by. I welcome your questions, comments, and tips. Till next time, a ciao for... Now, let's see if we can do this without trouble.